for non-violent protest in support of the Tibetan independence. She was subjected to torture and ill treatment throughout her detention in prison in Tibet. This lasted for more than 11 years. In 1994, while in Drabji prison, she and other nuns clandestinely recorded songs and poems in tribute of their homeland and for His Holiness the Dalai Lama. The recording made it out of Tibet and the world heard, heard the haunting songs that tell of hardships in prison life and women's undying song, undying cry for freedom. Now, what's under love?